Hello, guys. Spam, spam, spamity spam. We are back in uh, Modcraft Survival, where in the last episode, we built a smeltery, which is very handy, and we also got some iron chests, nice. which was just sort of like a last minute sort of thing. But we have a lot of iron. And a lot of iron means that we have to do something with that iron. So I'm going to officially start working on a lot of Tinker's Construct stuff. Don't know if we'll, like, get on to making any special tools yet. Maybe we will. I mean, let's be honest. I need an upgrade from this stone sword, but... I'm just gonna clear out this little space in here. We don't need any of that. I love our house. It's a good house. Alright, I got- I have everything from back there with me right now. And I'm going to be moving it here. Well, furnaces... Can just, uh, you know, go boop. Also, we have a chicken sword. I don't know what I'm gonna do with that, so I'll just leave it in there. Okay, we have more iron. Good. We can make two more iron chests. And... Doop doop. Alright. So, let's see. <clears throat> At Tinker's Construct. Okay, blank patterns, those are simple. Then we're gonna need, like, a... Okay, so we've got a crafting station. We need a stencil table. Okay, yeah, I, I can make that. I can make that. That's simple. There's also that mine shaft we can explore. There is. Okay, so we... Dang it. We don't have any extra... Sticks, I don't think. So, let me... Uh, here's 27. Oh. Thanks. Let's create a lot of stencils. Then, there we go, we've got a stencil table. And then I think... Uh, part builder. Okay, I need just a straight-up log. Just one log, so I take that. Eh, eh. Oil ocean? Yeah, why not? Hmm. Recipe thing, go away. And... Tool station. We don't want a tool station. We want a tool forge. Oh. Dude, our house is just so plain. I know. Okay. Hey, uh... Yeah. I'm gonna make some iron blocks. And I'm going to start setting up a little thing out here for us. So let's see, crafting station, stencil table, part builder. Here, take two seeds. You're the farm boy. Farm boy. The volume is still messed up. Thanks, Windows. Boo. I have a feeling if I fall in there, I'd start taking damage.
Okay, so we've got... Oh, it got dark quick. <clears throat> yep, it does that. E, 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 e. Do, 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 do. There we go. Boop. Let me think. At iron chest, um. we can create a... We can create... Gold chest, do we have any gold? Yeah, we do have gold. So let me take you. Let me actually create a gold chest for... Yeah. Out over here. Let me create a gold chest, I'll put it there. And we have a lot of space in that guy. Oh shit! So tool forge. We can just do straight up block of gold, but hey, wait. How do you create? Just straight up seared stone. Oh, yeah, that's stone in a smeltery. Tool forge. Consumes cast. Hey, where did you take some iron? Draco? I need iron blocks. Are you there? No. Hi. No. What? Where did it go? Thank you. Oh, there it is. Thank you. Okay, so now... I need, um... Seared Cobblestone. He's so little! He's so little. The crafting bench. And the iron blocks. This is so little! Also, look in the gold chest. Yeah, I know, that's a lot of space. Put! Put! Come on. Come on, I want to finish this. I want to create the tool forge. Mining is pretty good. Tool forge. It's really good. Come on. Come on. Okay, we have seared stone. Wait. Oh, that's not enough. We need more. Okay. So I think you need four. So let me do that. Just need a line of seared stone across the top and then that'll be it. You okay, man? Fighting off a skeleton. Ew.
Python ein. Need to move that to the bottom. A lot of prosperity ore here. Good. I'm in the mine shaft. I hope that's okay. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. You can be our resource gatherer. And that was a I perfect like amount. Stuff. That was a perfect amount. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme. Oh, we we need a tool station first. Right there. And behold, the pièce de résistance, pièce de résistance. First of all, I'm going to move these way there. We have our tool forge. Which means we can make all kinds of great stuff. Like a long sword. A long, long sword is an offensive weapon. It's often used for charging into battle at full speed. Long swords are my jam. So let's see. Gold at the are bottom. My jam. Ah. Okay. Let's see. I think we have this mod installed. How do we make a magic mirror? Yes. Okay, we need a net. Okay, yeah, we're a ways away from that. You alright, Jerko? I don't want to make the spiders mad. Because you know me. I hate dealing with cave spiders. Oh, well, cave spiders are just jerks. And you. Yes, you can uncraft those. Cool. Flint. Yes. But you know, we do actually want flint. Okay, stencil. First of all, tool rod. Second of all, uh, binding. Oh, the sharpening kit's going to be useful. Large sword blade. Sword blade. Pickaxe. That's gonna be handy, that's gonna be handy. And let's start with that for now. So. Put the flint in there. First off, sharpening kit. Hand guard. Wide guard. Tool rod is going to be important. Large sword head. Oh, that cost a lot. Uh, binding. Pickaxe. And nope, we don't have enough of that. But the reason why I grabbed these is. Holds at the bottom. Yes, we can create casts! Yay! So then that. Normally I would make these out of bone first, but. Oh, wait. We have a lot of gold. Yeah. We don't need the parts with us right now. Okay, sharpening kit. That's another good one to have. Hand guard. Wide guard. How much gold? Yeah, we still have more gold. Good. Sh 
Should be able to make everything that we need. At least, right now. And then that, and that's the last one that I have right now. Okay, now to design my sword. Because we don't have a whole lot of options right now, let's just go iron. Come on, cool. Ah, thank you. Attack four. Let's also do an iron tour. I don't know. God, it's getting dark. Okay. Did we happen to get any paper? Yes, we did. Cool. Behold all of our new stuff. For the sake of modify. I don't want that one. I want the part. The pattern. Okay. There we go. Take that. Take that out. Put those back in, and tool forge. I should... Schnorfels. I made the wrong one. We want just the normal sword head for the long sword. I'm a moron. It's been a while, okay? So that goes in there, I guess. Guess I'm not gonna be getting any sleep tonight. I'll, I'll be there in a minute, Draco. I'm, I'm, I'm working. I'm building myself a sword. I'm crafting myself a sword. I have a vanilla stone sword, and I'm okay with that. At least for now. And boom. Iron longsword. The reason why I like longswords? You can do a lunge, which allows you to basically go whoop. Ha! It's perfect, I, I love it. I what it is with you and your mobility. Mobility is important. Okay. So, where's all the new stuff that we got? Ooh. Thank you. Block of Inferium Essence, huh? Yep. Strange dreams. When I do dream, I do have strange dreams. Hmm. What can we do? Cooking chicken. I'm just going to be processing some ores real quick. Then I'm going to make a few new iron pickaxes. 
And then we'll go down to the mine shaft or something? Alright. I've already cleaned out a little bit, which is where that stuff came from. Yeah. I mean, you can't expect me to just hang around all day, can you? No. Mine shaft's really not all that far. <laughs> okay, yeah, we have a lot of stuff. You want me to just wait for you? Well, I'm just making sure that this iron is going, then I'm gonna get this iron block, and then I'm gonna make us three new iron pickaxes each. So awesome. that... Not tinkers yet. I want to wait until we have, like, better materials to, like, invest in a tinker's pickaxe. And yet you have a tinker's sword. Well, yeah. Don't try to deny it. But pickaxes are different than swords. Obviously. Well, obviously. Way to state the obvious there, Svens. We could probably use some of that leftover iron to craft us to craft ourselves some full-on suits. Iron plates. Because really, the st the stuff I'm wearing now is stuff I've got I got from loot bags. Yeah. Well, there, there's some, there's three new iron pickaxes. Thanks, buddy. You're welcome. We can get iron armor. Why didn't I think about armor? I don't know. Alright, uh... Ain't got cast. Can't you also craft blocks into ingots? Yes. But this allows us to go a little bit faster. You know? Do I take the block? It, it just finished. Taking the block. Okay, so we need 48 iron. In order to craft two full sets. Do we have any backpacks? No. There, we have enough for one full set. And this last ingot will push us over. Alright. And then we fall down. It pushed me over! Ma'am! An apple a day keeps the doctor away. There we go. Suit up! Boom, 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 boom. Boom! We are silver now. I am Iron Man. Pretty much, yeah. Now the time is near for Iron Man to spread fear. Craft myself an iron shovel. Uh, torches! Torches would be nice to have. Yeah. 
Can I hear it? Give me a moment, man. I have a couple of sticks and some coal. I can craft myself some torches. 20 torches. Perfect. Simply perfect. And, and boom. now in terms of food... I have four stacks of torches. Damn. Refresh on coal. We'll get plenty of cobble down there, so I don't need to take any. Get rid of my sword. Keep my strange dreams in there. In terms of food, I'll take more chicken. Alright, so what do you think? Are we ready? Um... Draco? Oh! Where did I point at? Um, okay. Uh. Mineshaft 1. Gold, because treasure. Waypoint, default, and... There! Where'd you go? Okay, there you are, I see you. Ugh. That's the one- that's the one place I don't think I've been. I'm trying to hit you! Uh, no, that's an axe! Alright, well that's taken care of. Careful. Dreaming doggo. Meh. Yeah. Ooh, I got a loot bag! What could be inside? Seriously, a dead end? Oh, well, yeah. What'd I get? Gold chest plate, six gunpowder, seven sand, and wheat. Not great, but alright. This seems new. Prosperity ore. I found a lot of that when I was down here. Uh, there's more spiders. There's lava there. I actually need gravel for... Uh, grout, so I will gladly take all that. Eh, gimme. I love this game. Minecraft is pretty amazing. It's close to perfect. Oh, but my durability on that. Oh god, the durability is shitty. I might have to go home in a minute and make some sharpening kits. We got shinies over here. This crystals. A lot of them. What type is this? Air. More crystals. Hey! Get out of here with your face. Kinda nice how they emit light. Yeah. But I have a feeling that we're gonna need a lot of those vase crystals eventually. Hi. Hi! I took some of your iron. Because it fell. There's a lot of overworld quartz here. Not complaining. 
More crystals. Through Tinker's construct logic, quartz equals more damage. Anything good down here? Of that, what's that called again? Cinnabar. <gasps> okay. I hate water in Minecraft. In real life, I actually really enjoy water. I like to swim. I found one of these big square rooms. With dirt on the floor? Yeah. Yeah, those are always interesting. A minecart with chests! Oh, it's just coal, gold, a name tag, some beetroot seeds, and a bunch of rails. That's actually pretty good. I leave the rails. I don't use rails often. Neither do I. They can be handy sometimes, though. I just don't find them to be really useful. No. <laughs> just no. I have the pens. Whoa, okay. Everything on everything alright, man? Uh huh. Shit. Let's just do what we always do. Hijack some nuclear weapons and hold the world hostage, yeah? Yeah. Sounds good, Doctor. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Nope. Ah, the creeper! Hey. I found the blue stuff. Okay, that creeper was having a spaz attack. There are three of them in there. I wish I had a bow and arrow. What? What the? What the what? Something weird just happened. What just happened? Hey! They're smart. That was scary. I've never seen two Cinnabar or right next to each other. It's weird. Got a common loot back from a creeper, and I know you guys are hiding around that corner now. Hmm. Okay, well, one of them exploded, but it didn't kill. But it didn't hit me. Cool. It is nerve wracking to fight those guys with a stone sword, especially when there are three of them in one mine shaft corridor, and you're frantically hiding behind, hiding around a corner. Creepers. Creepers. Hmm. Really wish I had a bow and arrow right about now. Well, do you have sticks with you? Or planks or anything? No. 
Hmm. But I'm alive. Ooh. And that's what matters. Alright. So, let me see. What is it? Control? Yes. Home. There we are. Home. Home. Yes. Thank you, E.T. What even was that noise? Hotel. Hotel. Oh, hey! You find something creeper, good? Did... No, that loot bag from the creeper? Yeah. Gave me some pretty nice stuff. One loaf of bread, two string, a stone axe, a diamond, and a golden sword. A diamond, huh? Which, for my efforts, I think I deserve. Using my skills at trickery, I managed to f defeat those three creepers and survive. Granted, two of them exploded, and I only killed one of them, but... a I like how the minimap allows me... Well, like, I like how it allows you to sort of see where mobs are and just hunt them down. That's some interesting generation right there. Ooh, orange crystals. Ignis! Let me up. More creepers! Getting zombie brains. You have gained temporary warp. I don't know what that means. Thanks, tree. Because of you, a creeper exploded. Thankfully, didn't destroy anything in the house. What happens if I eat another zombie brain? You gained temporary warp. What does that mean? Zombie brain from Thumbcraft. Controls. Are there any like. Why is that in the red? Is there any like. Thumbcraft thing? Oh no, that needs to be shift. Zero's minimap, draconic evolution, Thumbcraft. Change caster focus. What does that mean? I can't do anything with that right now. So much treasure. Good for you. And I'm out of torches. Thermometer. Ah, oh, we can make that. Sand. Where do we have sand? Where do we put sand? We had is sand. It is it a thermometer or a thermometer? I don't know. I'm it's confused. Thermometer, whatever, one of the things.
Technically, I guess it would be thalmometer, but... Sand for glass. Then I think we're gonna need a little bit of extra gold, so let me put the gold on the bottom and get four ingots. I can leave this quartz. I actually think that we have one left in the chest, so we'll just grab three. Yes. What? Quicksilver? What did we get Quicksilver from? You get Quicksilver from Cinnabar! Oh. So that's what it is! Good to know. Come on, one more, one more. Redstone! You found Redstone? Yes. I'm outside the mine shaft. And is it not there? Wish I had an ender pouch. Why is it not working? Maybe a different crafting table? Gold. And glass panes. That doesn't. What's wrong? Can it's I... not working. Man. Is there like a conflicting recipe or something anywhere? I don't think there would be. That's weird. I'm thinking about that random thing that I musically said one time in a distressful situation. Yeah. Everything about this is bad. Mirror glass. Sanity checker. More skeletons. Huh? Okay, this is all very weird. Does the sorcerer has a confuzzled? I do kind of has a confuzzled. I got an ender pearl from a common loot bag. Really? Huh. And I want it. <laughs> How'd you find that mine shaft, by the way? Caving. Hmm. Ooh, there were this crystals just over here. Also a couple of sheep in case we want to start a farm sometime. Which would probably be a smart thing to do sometime. Anyway, I'm going exploring to try and find myself a cave. Or just wander around, see the sights, find a new place, I don't know. I am mining in complete darkness with no torches. How do you do this to yourself? 
I think the question is, why do I do this to myself? Why do you do that to yourself? I don't know. It's a big tree. I see lava on the mini-map over there. Don't... Please. Don't freeze. Don't freeze on me. Don't... Well, I can still do stuff, so I think it'll respond in a minute. Wait. I think we're doomed. Wait, yeah, are you back? No, I'm a, I'm a, I'm back in. I'm back in. Okay. We were not doomed. That's a cool looking cliff. I like that. So how's your no torch adventure going? Dark. I can only imagine how much stuff you're missing. Because it's so dark. Well, I can still see fine. Oh. Especially since I'm currently traveling along a lava channel. With my trusty water bucket in hand. Are you just trying to rub it in my face that I don't usually carry a water bucket? Oh. Which warp? I'll okay. let you be the judge of that. There's a lot of clay here. So I'm getting the clay. Green would be so proud. Green would be so proud. Yeah. Ah! Water currents! Why do you do this to me? What do? Okay. Get out. Okay. I crafted myself. I crafted some myself some more torches with what little sticks I had and a bit of coal. Okay. So you did have some sticks. Somehow. Loot bag, maybe. Sure, I can mine iron ore with a water bucket. Stop Yoku blocking me! Ooh. That's pretty. Oh! Okay. Pick up the thing. I found a pretty area. Oh, and from the looks of the map, there's a slime island nearby. Yep. Two. Cool. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, what the hell? What? Something pushed me off of that. Vishroom. 
Are these used? Nope, those aren't used in any form of crafting. Magical forest biome. Hmm. Okay. We have 24 gravel. So many vis crystals. They're only used to create arcane stones. Is that worth it? Arcane stone. Yeah, they're used to make a lot of stuff. Arcane pedestal. Hmm. What's that? Arcane curiosity. Arcane grappler. Did you just say arcane rapper? Grappler. Oh. Why can't... The real thing that I'm wondering is why can't I create a thalmometer? Also, does the... Does this only include vanilla items? No, flower basket... Yeah, this... Uh, coarse silty dirt, what? Is there something that I have to- that we have to do before we can create a thumb- a thumbometer? Strange Dreams by Hatred Elmer. Took three of those strange crystals I've been founding and got them with a handful of redstone in a bowl using a piece of flint. You found redstone, correct? Ow! Yes, and I also found a skeleton that promptly shot me in the face. Oh wait, we have redstone. Ow, stop sniping me, you little... That's what you get. A piece of flint, and we also have... Yes, bowl. So... Sparka! Salus Mundus. English, please. Salus. What's it? What the heck is that used for? Oh, right. We click it on a bookshelf. I forgot. Wait. Okay, it, it's good. We're good. We're all good. I'm curious about something. Do we have drawing racks? Yes, you do. We do have drawing racks. Which 
means that we can get monster jerky. Good to know. So, leather... Holy... Holy hell, I'm filthy stinking rich. Good for you. We have some paper, not a lot. Watch out, Draco. Heh! <laughs> Old memories are returning to me. Guess what I'm doing? What? I'm searching for sugarcane. <laughs> Good times. Hello, spider. There are a lot of mobs over here. Two of them are- three of them are creepers. Okay. Scary noises. I, I'm scared. Damn it, creepers. Damn it, Jerry! Pretty much. Alright. Uh, there's a swamp over here. When I started out here, all it was a swamp. The other king said that was tough to build a castle in the swamp. But I did it all the same just to show him. Sank into the swamp. So, I built the second one. That one sank into the swamp as well. The third one burned down, fell over, then sank into the swamp. But the fourth one stayed up. Guess what I and found? That's what you're gonna. What? Slimes! Sugarcane, there. You okay. interrupted my expert reenacting of some of the greatest satirical comedy in the history of ever to tell me that you found some bouncing cubes of jello. Yes. Oh god. I can see that. Get away from me! This is bad. about this is bad this does not fill me with confidence sorry I've been trying to come up with more lyrics I'm poisoned oh come on poison go away Oh shit. That is not a normal village. That is not a good village. Oh. I did the smart thing and teleported out of there back home. Because I have a shit ton of treasure. Good for you. I'm almost dead. Oh shit. Okay. Well, get out of there. Come back <sighs> home. Please. There was a slime that I could kill. Whoa, that zombie had red eyes! Okay, got a loot bag. More zombie brains. Jesus Christ. Come on. Rare loot bag. I Music got it. This cat and two wheat. And a zombie brain. You've gained temporary warp. I have no idea what that means. Neither do I. And the slime despawned. Wah. 
All right, I'm back. Hello. Hi. Here, Draco. Take these and plant them somewhere. All right. I gotta go back outside and get some of that stuff. Or not. There we go. We got a one bookshelf. Hey, hey, Drake, can you come over here and do me a favor? Yeah, what's the favor? Over by the smell tree. Come on. Yeah. Please? I'm coming. I'm coming. Could you pick up this stuff? Yeah. Doop, doop, I take. I can't do anything with that. Wait, do we have the... We do have an uncrafting table! <gasps> That's the best! Also, come over here. Look into the treasure chest. Yeah? Behold my winnings. Wow. Nice. Wow. Oh, shit. Holy shit. That's like... That's the equivalent of six stacks of iron you have there! I am a professional iron miner. Well, uh, Draco, real quick, come here. Come here. First of all, I get that. This is Salus Mundus. This is what you get when you do that thing that the Strange Dreams said. Oh! <laughs> Salmonomicon! The Salmonomicon. <laughs> First steps. Who would have thought that a few sprinkles of dust could have created this marvelous book? It is mostly blank, but it hints at a powerful new form of magic. Thal uh, thaumaturgy. Thaumaturgy. Firstly, I will need to study the magical world that has been shown to me. For that, I will need a tool. A yes! Wait. A, th a, thalmo a thalmometer, the book calls it. A new t yeah, we need a tool. A normal crafting table won't do, however, since the magical energies I need to channel while crafting it are quite delicate. A sprinkle of salus mundus on a mundane crafting table should solve that. The book has taught me the proper incantation to use, so it should be a simple matter. To get myself on track, I will make a list of all the requirements that need to be met on the first page of each entry. Can I stop you right there? Yeah. How do you get, Cinna How do you get Quicksilver from Cinnabar? Smelt it. In a furnace? Yeah. Okay, cool. Chuck that in there. I have to empty out a lot of my space. Okay, is there anything else in my strange dreams? Nope. Nothing else so far. Okay, so we have a normal crafting table here that I was going to use to create an uncrafting table. So I'll create a second one. It's actually not a bad spot for one. Hello, sheep. So... There we go, we have an uncrafting table. Now I need... More Viz Crystals. And let's create more... Oh, with Redstone, right. There, Salus Mundus. Now, I'm gonna put this crafting table over here, and let's see what happens. da 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 Whoa! What? what is that? Oh. That looks fun! Wait. Types of knowledge. Completing. Progress! Now I have an arcane workbench at my disposal. It works much, much like a mundane crafting table and can even be used as such. However, that can be used as a normal crafting table too? Oh! 
However, there are a few key differences. Mostly, many arcane recipes will require the use of those vis crystals I've been finding of late. Uh, they act as a focus for the magical energy I need to channel into the items I craft. This book, the book calls this magical energy viz. Supposedly, this energy is all around me, but as yet I cannot, but as yet I cannot perceive or measure it. It is time that I craft the thalmo the thalmometer and use it to study the world around me. It should clearly mark those things I still need to examine. I have placed a bookmark to the thalmometer recipe on the right. Okay, air, terra, aqua, ignis, ordo, and peridot. I think I have all of those. I think we have all of those. Air. What else was it that we needed? Um. Terra, aqua, ignis. Terra, aqua, Ignis. You got four, needed you've got four pain. golden ingots and a glass pane here. I know. Let's see what happens when I place these here. Ooh. Ooh. The thermometer. Wait, did you make it? Oh no, it's there. There it is. I got it. Oh. You've learned nothing new. Can I see it? I mean, oh! you're not using it. I learned new stuff. Did you scan me? Nothing new can be learned from this. There, take it. Um, how do you use it? Uh, try shift right clicking on a crafting table. Get anything you've new from that? You've learned something new. You've learned something new. Hey, Alright, now, you you've had a sample. That, that That's mine. Can I heave it back? You can make your own. Here, I'll. Uh, I'll. You can make another bookshelf. You can do all kinds of stuff. We have an uncrafting table. Ah, we have an uncrafting table. That's so nice. Oh, right, it costs experience to uncraft stuff. Right. Don't. Alright. Complete! Such strange wonder wonders are being revealed to me. Peering through the lens of the thalmometer shows me, shows me a world coursing with magic. Viz, as the books call it. Uh, normally this energy is a pure ocean of magic that ebbs and flows, but it also permeates all things, both animate and inanimate. The book calls Viz in this state Essentia, where Viz is formless and pure. Essentia is more rigid in its nature and falls into a multitude of clearly defined types, each mixing together with others to form greater and more complex types of Essentia. I'm not quite sure if the matter is bound to get... I'm not... I am not quite sure if the matter it is bound to gives Essentia its nature, or that the very nature of matter depends on the Essentia it contains. This bears further study. I'm keeping a log of all the types of Essentia I discover. A bookmark on the left will show my current knowledge. For now, I need to focus my energies elsewhere. Studying Essentia might be a good place to start. Okay, so these are different forms of Essentia, like Terra. Yeah. Yeah, we've seen that. Knowledge totals. Huh. I have my own thermometer now. Ooh. Discovering yes. alchemy. You have not yet begun this research. Types of knowledge. There are two main types of knowledge, observations and theories. They are further subdivided into main research categories like alchemy and artifice. Observations are notes and discoveries you have made in the real world by scanning objects. Practical observation often gives insights into how these things work, and by keeping field notes of those observations, you will slow- and by keeping field notes of those observations, you will slowly build a solid base of knowledge to work from. Theories. In a nutshell, theories in a nutshell are ways of understanding things through careful observation, rational thought, and practical experimentation. Much of thalma 
liturgical research requires crafting theories to better understand research categories. Hmm. Discovering alchemy. Theory crafting. I scan all the things! Whoa. You've learned something new. Oh, there's a meter down there. Or, or well, over there. Okay, so if it sparkles when you hover over it, you can learn stuff from it. Good to know, good to know. You've learned something new. I scanned a sheep. You scanned a sheep? Good for you. Learn something new, learn something new, learn something new. Okay, that's kind of cool. Oh, bobbles. Why is bobbles there? Can I do anything with bobbles? Right. Let's sleep. Okay, this is interesting. You cannot scan that. You cannot scan that! I'm going to be moving all this up here. I'm going to be moving the Thaumcraft stuff upstairs, because we really need to have something up there. Scan that. Ooh! You learned something new. How do you access the new knowledge? I think it's just from the Thaumonomicon. And knowledge totals. Observation fundamentals. I don't have a Thaum I don't have a Thaumonomicon. Then make one. It's a good way to actually pro progress through it. How do I do that? Here's a hint. Well, yeah, I know I need to... There, there's some of those just for you right now. You're gonna need a bookshelf. Yeah, so... Some planks. Do we have any spare planks anywhere here? Yeah, I have some. There. Thanks. You're welcome. And we need some books. Alright, but this is kind of cool. You've learned something make new. One book. Great. You've learned something new. This is gonna be like playing Metroid Prime, you have to scan all the things. Yes. That's one of my favorite parts about Metroid Prime, is scan all the things. Scanning sheep! Okay. I'm liking this. We're finally getting into the heavily modded stuff! Yay! But, anyway, with that, this is Hatred Elemental and Draco so to Zero signing out. Uh, we hope that you guys enjoyed, and we will see you again next time, where we'll be doing more stuff with Tinker's Construct, and, uh, Thaumcraft, and all kinds of stuff. Yeah. Just, it's about time we to end the episode, magic. you know. We do has magic. So, yeah, I guess, goodbye. Bye.
Scanning friends! Uh, 